good day friends it is me HL Mod Tech and I am back with another 3D printing video so let's get cracking friends today we are going to be updating firmware on the Mingda Magician one way to get to the website is by visiting my website hlmodtech.com when you click on this we simply need to click on support and we need to go to the firmware and software page as you scroll down there is the Magician X2 click on it and download our firmware I'm gonna put mine in the downloads and hit save once I visit that folder with Explorer and then I'm gonna extract it with 7-zip it is free it is awesome and you can see right here I can extract it and it'll make a folder that holds the firmware file it is a simple firmware bin we need to place that on the SD card I'm gonna insert my SD card right now I'm gonna do a copy and let's go over here and do a right click paste so it is firmware bin right now I'm gonna safely eject that and let's take it over to the 3d printer all right everybody so as you can see the printer is off here is the SD card notice it says this side down let's place it in and then we simply power on the printer and let it do the firmware update this is interesting notice the screen is upside down as that happens one hundred percent and after a moment she reboots and we're back in business let's check that menu settings we go to info we have got brand new firmware 1.6.8.3 dated May 26 2023 all right so let me back you out and let me show you the big thing that I'm excited about right now when we go to extrude we now have an unload button I'll keep you updated on other things I find but that was what I wanted to show you with this brand new firmware update all right everybody since I've updated the firmware let's get back to the main menu and let's do the bed leveling once again it heats up the hot end I'm gonna speed up this heating real quickly with some video skills kind of interesting that it heats the hot end before the bed and finally here we go of course let's watch this at 3x speed as well the entire process in real time takes less than five minutes I have been so impressed so far with how well the Mingda Magician is printing I seem to always get great first layers and I've had success using PEG PLA and some NGen filament from ColorFab that dates all the way back to 2016. The final thing I want to double check is my baby step. I'm going to let it do the homing. And then I have found with my printer negative 0.02 is what I need. Notice I have to switch to the 0.1 and then if I wanted to decrease or increase, it is a simple one tap just like that. And then make sure you hit save to lock it in. And finally, confirm. Now we're ready for a test print. Friends, let's check it out. We have got a PETG HL Mod Tech 
Happy Crab. How slick is that? Once again, HL Mod Tech logo and the Ming the Magician X2. Absolutely crushing it. One other quick reminder, once you have finished, bring your SD card back to your computer, plug it in and track down that firmware. It'll now be .cure and simply click on it and delete it. Friends, as I wrap up this video, I just want to remind you about my website, hlmodtech.com. As you can see, I've got the page about 3D printing. You can see all the printers that I have or have worked with here. And also down at the bottom, there is a sweet built-in message until you can click that button, add your question, comment, or suggestion, and reach me almost instantly. And of course, friends, if you enjoyed the video, please give it a like. Please also hit that share button so more people can learn about HL Mod Tech. Don't forget you absolutely make my day if you take time to leave a comment down below. And if you haven't subscribed yet, what are you waiting for? Smash that subscribe button. And last but not least, hit that notification bell if you want to be the first to know when there's a brand new video from me, HL Mod Tech. Thanks for watching. Have a great day.